On our Cisco router, if we want to run a trace route, it's a little bit different than on a Windows computer. First, let's go ahead and ping an address that we know is valid just to make sure that we're up. And there it is. So now we type the word trace route. And we'll do that same IP address. Hit enter. And now it will tell us how many hops it is to get to that location that we're trying to trace to. And then we can determine uh, if we'd like to change up our routing or if there's some other troubleshooting that we need to do. So since this is directly connected to the router, it got us there in just one hop. Now let's try to trace to something we know is unreachable. And one of the frustrating things is there's no control C to stop a trace route. On a Cisco router, there's actually a different key command. So if it's something that's unreachable, it will go 30 hops, and that could take several minutes. So in order to get out of a trace where it's just unreachable to get to the IP address, hold down the control, the shift, and the number 6, and then that will stop it.